what's up you guys welcome back to my channel so today i will take you to grocery shopping so wala na pala akong pagkain dito <laughs> so usually um what i do is naglilista muna ako ng mga bibilin ko pero alam niyo naman talaga guys di ba minsan naman maglilista ka but really, hindi naman talaga yun yun yung susunod eh. <laughs> Pero syempre, iba pa rin kapag may guide ka para you're not gonna go out of budget. Diba? So chinat ko yung fridge namin dito. Yeah. Tatlo kasi kami nagsishare dito sa bahay. So, um, <coughs> ito yung freezer namin. Ito yung fridge and freezer. So see? Wala. Wala nang laman, guys. So, yun. I'm just gonna list down all the things that I might need. That I'll be needing. And let's go! But before I go, guys, um, breakfast muna tayo. So, usually what I'm... Eating in the morning. Uh, actually, kapag may work ako, ano lang? Usually coffee lang. Coffee lang yung tinitake ko. And then, I will have my breakfast at work. And the usual breakfast that I have, cereals. Favorite ko na nga cereals eh. Diba parang bata lang. <laughs> so yeah. This is Cheerios. Sarap din siya. Marami siyang mga kuha na ng um, content and then this one. So, kino compile ko lang siya usually, and it tastes really good. Let me, you guys, it is very important. Na, you really have to take care of yourself, especially kung OFW ka, saan ka man sa mundo. And you just really need to nourish yourself. Kailangan, hindi lang tayo puro tulong sa family. Siyempre, kailangan nating alagaan din yung sarili natin. Unang-una na dyan, of course, yung food. And usually ako, I'm not really into fancy food or anything. Usually, kung ano lang binibili ko, yung parin yung the usual na kinangay ko sa Pilipinas, but of course, I'm trying to to enjoy the food here in Ireland as well. This is the shopping bags dito kasi eco friendly ang Ireland. So let's go. Mm. Alam niyo malamig ngayon dito sa Ireland. Summer time na tapat eh. but it's always gloomy for the past few days, and it's somewhat drizzling as well. Alright, you guys. So, yan yung pinto namin. Okay. Hmm, wala mig. I checked today. It's around 12 degrees Celsius. So, it's kind of very cold actually. So, yeah. This is where I live. Nature na nature kasi may mga birds pa dyan. So, dadaling ko kayo. And by the way, I'm just walking um, I'm just walking towards the grocery store kasi malapit lang naman siya. Roughly about less than a kilometer maybe. And uh, alam nyo na, hindi naman ganun kahirap maglakad kasi malamig. So, hindi ka madudugyot. <laughs> Dito sa Ireland guys, marami kang pwedeng pagpilian where they want to do the shopping. <clears throat> Pag mga grocery items, usually sa Dunn store ako pupunta. Pero meron din naman na uh, Lidl and of course Aldi. So ngayon, inisip ko pa kung saan ako mag-shopping. Kaya inisip ko baka sa Lidl. Kasi sa Lidl, mura lang siya. Mura yung mga items doon. Ang laki pala ng mukha ako sa gulong to, no? 
dalawang shops na sinabi ko yun yung German shops and they are actually fairly cheap compared to Don's Guys, kanina ko pa iniisip kung saan ako mag-grocery shopping. Sa Duns ba? Duns is on that side. Dun. Or dito sa Lido. 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 Hmm. But I decided to go to Lido. Saka, pasok tayo. Dito guys, like any other grocery stores, mga nakabundle yung mga items dito. So like this, onions, there you go. It's chilies. But it is good. So I told you earlier guys, may listahan ako pero hindi ko naman ginagamit. <laughs> Please just have to say you guys, or if you want something na makakain nyo agad, like this, chicken bacon pasta salad mga ready ano na siya ready to eat egg mayonnaise potato salad diba? pizza a lot more meat section tayo guys so yan so same thing din naman you have the beans pork just this. So every time you buy you really have to check the price. Pork or beef? Try not to pork. Get on you guys. We have salmon. Skittles. Three euro. What did not? And how about steak? Four euro. I don't know what to do with steak. So, okay, let's try that. So, there are hot dogs. Dito mo guys yung chicken section. Tinan nyo. 2 euro siya. It's around uh, maybe 100 plus pesos. For a 1 kilo of chicken pie. For a day. So dito sa little guys. Parang siyang SM department store. So meron din siya mga items. Aside from food. Diba? Kaya mga picnic rugs. Doormats, radio, and many more. How many do you guys have uh, yogurt? Mm. I'm going to need that. And how much is this? 1.3. Not bad. Two 
tulad nyo din ba ako guys na uh, mahilig tumingin sa mga mga items na hindi mo naman kailangan <laughs> so in the end para mapapabili ka din diba? ang okay, daming items eh buting buting ting ka lang o oh, ganun nice Guys, we're done here. So, ayan na yung mga napabili ko. So, mamaya mag-haul tayo. Okay? See you later. Nakakapagod, guys. <laughs> so, I just got home. Kasi ang bigat ng bit-bit ko. And, uh, para na ako nag-workout. Alam niya. Anyhow, so ito yung mga pinamili ko, okay? okay? Parang good for two weeks na to, or, or more actually. Kasi ang dami kong meat products na binili na. Usually, ni store ko lang yan sa, sa freezer. So guys, bumili ako ng mga pork, chicken, pork again, chicken wings. Hili ko sa chicken, no? And then, this is ground pork, coconut milk, chips. Hindi mo mawala yan. And pita partner kain sa humus. Lo, nasa na humus ko. This one. Ah. And then fruit. Yeah, fruits. A lot of fruits. Okay. Yeah, I also bought some ice cream. There we go. So yeah, baby powder. Lam niya naman. Mahirap na mo mabaho tayo. <laughs> and then the yogurt and honey. Lagi partner yan. And then I have the shrimp here from pasta. Black bean paste, we have the salmon, and that's it. Okay guys, all of these items cost 50 euro, around 2,800 pesos siya. Not too bad, di ba? Lalo na uh, na siya, for, for good for two weeks na din siya. So, that's about it guys. Maraming salamat sa pagsama niyo sa aking paggrocery shop. And if you like this video, please do subscribe to my channel. And press mo na rin yung like button dyan. And of course, the notification bell, para naman notified ka kapag may mga bago akong uploads. Okay, salamat and see you soon!